I refuse to let it be my life. It was my life. <laughs> you know, you can't, you got to live in the moment, you know, because you're a prisoner and, you know, you're reminded of that a lot. But it won't always be one. Actually, I really tried very hard to stay myself okay. and not kind of get into, you know, get into the groove of what was popular and all that kind of stuff. So is this room here kind of your, your oasis because this is where No, no, play? this is work. <laughs> yep. They got some, well, they got some new stuff. Now, this is the room that looks really small. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is the one that looks pretty small. You know, in the summertime, you know, we would open the windows so everybody could, you know, hang around and listen to the music and stuff. Definitely the faith brought me hope. And, you know, with hope, uh, I had to prepare myself for when that time would come. But well, sure, I got anger. Well, how come you've never showed it? Because it's so small compared to how, you know, good life is, you know, how good my future is, you know, it doesn't compare. So, you know, plus it's a waste of energy. It really is. That's the biggest thing, you know. I tried it, you know, going with the angry life. It got me nowhere. So I, I stopped.